Hey, in other news, Frank, do you guys watch SpongeBob at home? Uh, not really. Not really? No. Nah. You know, my almost senior father watches He's SpongeBob. A yeah, uh, guy's almost 60, but I don't, I don't understand. That. Anyway, uh, it looks like they found the real SpongeBob, though, under the sea. Check it out. Oh, They're just boy. chilling. <laughs> These are real things, by the way. Uh, the, the real photo. No, I'm not even joking. No, no, this is real. This ain't a set. Uh, now, here's the bad news, though, beautiful people. Sponges and starfish aren't friends at all, actually, in real life. Now, researchers say they believe they were just hanging out with each other for different reasons. <laughs> and it ain't love. Starfish <laughs> was the next to the sponge because the sponge is about to be devoured. No! And they, yeah, so they no. say. <laughs> That's how the story ends. <laughs> so they say that the sponge turned yellow. It's oh. basically like a, a defense mechanism. Uh, stay right. away, Star. Yeah, Put some hot so there's that. It. Put some hot sauce. <laughs> That, but that's so big, though the sponge, the the starfish will, will eat it. It's the same. It's the same color to the theme of the cartoon and everything. And you just perfect. need some little skinny legs and some tennis shoes and some eyeballs. Oh, uh, somebody's and working on that right now. How, you got I'll, it. I'll get out of the way. <laughs> get it. Get on it. I, I want to see that. Put some legs on and some eyes. Doesn't uh, doesn't SpongeBob wear a hat every once in a while? Yeah, he does. I'm yeah. looking for Squidward. Uh,